on September 17th in Lawndale, a neighborhood in Chicago, an 11 year old black girl by the name of Trinity Washington was brutally and verbally assaulted by two Hispanic women who were attending a Mexican Independence Day parade. Now, allegedly Trinity's little bitty dog named Barbie got in their way to which they stepped on, by the way, the dog is okay. Um, and they got mad and Trinity said that they, one of them picked up a bottle and threw it at her and hit her in her eye, okay? And then she said she fell and when she got back up, one of the women were coming toward her and punched her in her nose to where she blacked out and fell over again. She said it hurt really bad. She didn't know what was going on. And so Trinity's family, it sounds like they were there as well, said that those two Hispanic women uh, were hurling racial slurs toward them, the N-word to be exact. Now, Chicago Police Department says that it's being investigated as an aggravated assault on a child, but nobody is in custody as of yet. And I wanna know why isn't there anybody in custody as of yet? And what are you investigating? What do you need to know? A child was assaulted to the point of her needing two surgeries on her eye, to this point, they have damaged that child due to their racism of being mad that she was in the way. And she says, all I was trying to do was just, you know, get my dog out the way and walk my dog and then put her or him or whatever the dog is in the house. And that happened to me. So of course, Trinity's mom uh, named Wanda, she says she's very distraught and she wants justice for her child. And I agree, she should get justice. And which is why we need a hate crime bill because had uh, that have been an Asian child, y'all already know. It'd have been hell to pay for doing that to that child, especially if it was one of us doing that to that child because they have a hate crime bill. You can't even hardly look at them without getting a hate crime bill slapped on you, right? But as black people, we, we, we don't have any specific protections from us. And y'all don't believe that uh, nonsense that is being told to us, especially by some of these lap dogs of uh, the Democrats. Oh, the hate crime bill is for y'all too. It's not just for Asian. No, 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 no. Go read it for yourself. It's for them. It doesn't even say for everybody else or for black people too, right? It just doesn't. So we need a hate crime bill. And the other thing is, we need to get these do nothing Democrats up out of our neighborhood. Stop voting for those people. Cause as of this point, I haven't heard a whole bunch of Democrats, especially any from uh, Chicago raising the roof about what happened to that 11 year old baby. But again, as I said, had it been somebody else's child, oh yeah, they would have been, oh, we need a protections and this is wrong and this, that, and the other. They would have been quick to, you know, sign the bill and all that other stuff. But our babies, well, it's being investigated and we're going to see what we can do now. Don't, don't hold your breath, but we're going to see what we can do. But here that 11 year old child is traumatized because she's, you know, trying to put her dog in a house and those Hispanic women thought that they should take it upon themselves, uh, to, to brutalize her. Right. But they learn from white supremacy. Another thing too is about, about the Democrats. They are allowing, I don't know how long those women have been in the neighborhood, but they allow, uh, the migrants to come over to the black neighborhoods and, and we have to deal with them, right? They give them money and resources and they say, yeah, y'all, y'all deal with them. We just dropping them off and the rest of the problems are for y'all to deal with. And so if those women are migrants, I don't know if they are, but even if they ain't, you ain't got the right to come into our neighborhoods and do that to our people. You need to be held accountable. So anyway, y'all tell me what you think of that. And for more insightful commentary, please subscribe to this channel and my channel, the Demetri K show here on YouTube. Peace.